Hey there, Taurus. Welcome to your reading for the week of February 22nd. This week, you start with the Jack of Clubs, which is all about planning things out, planning for the future, uh, coming up with new plans, creating plans, planning, planning, planning. That's all that pretty much comes up for you on this card. So a lot of you could be, you know, getting ready to set some plans. And I will say, I mean, it's planning for movement to move forward in some way. Even moving comes up for some of you. Um, but also planning, you know, to move forward in some way. I mean, as you can see, he's on a horse. He's like ready to go. So it's uh, all this getting ready to plan something new. It could be a business. could be a relationship. It could be anything. Clubs represent everything to me. So it could be planning for almost anything and, and mostly planning for the future and getting really specific, looking at all the little details. So, you know, the Jack of Clubs would be super detail oriented and he's also really good at using his resources, you know, everything that he has. He doesn't need anything else. Like he has everything. Um, and, you know, so it can really mean that you have everything that you need to kind of move forward here. You just have to kind of do it with this card. And next we have the Nine of Hearts, which is a great card kind of represents the nine of cups in the tarot it, it's just a wish card getting something that you've been wishing for having things starting to happen that you want to have happen in your life and you might not see it this week um, it might take a little bit of time nines are incomplete they're odd numbered cards they want to be even numbers and as i always say these even numbered or the odd numbered cards they want to be an even number um so when you ever, whenever you get a card like this it can represent that it can take like a little bit of time for these to get what you want to get what you wish for but just know that things are moving forward and you are getting the things that you want uh next you have the king of spades very interesting that you have the uh, jack of clubs and the king of spades because you know, on one hand, the King of Spades could be somebody coming into your life for a lot of you. It could be somebody I'm feeling like a mentor, you know, coming in to offer like some advice or something like that. Um, but for most of you, I think it ties in with this resourcefulness of this Jack of Clubs. King of Spades is also incredibly resourceful. They're the two like most resourceful cards of the deck. And the Jack, uh, the uh, King of Spades here, he doesn't, you know, I always say that he doesn't look to necessarily grow his kingdom like out. He just looks at what he's already got in his kingdom and how he can improve it. So a lot of you could be like with this Jack of Clubs, the King of Spades could be looking at how you could be improving things in your life and everywhere. Like I said, it could be your relationships, it could be your businesses, jobs, getting new jobs, figuring new things out. And now that I say that, I feel like a lot of you are figuring, you're probably very different than you were, you know, a couple of years ago and really figuring things out and, and what you want your life to look like, um, especially with this card, really trying to like grow things inside your life uh, and make them better. And next you have the Eight of Hearts, kind of also ties in well with those two cards because with the Eight of Hearts, we can finally put energy into things and get that energy back. So if you've been trying to work on something in your life, just know that with this Eight of Hearts, you can finally start putting that energy in and getting it back. A lot of the times when we get an Eight of Hearts or any one of the sixes, so basically those five cards, the, any of the sixes or the Eight of Hearts, we've been trying to like put energy into things. We've been trying to move businesses forward, trying to move relationships forward and like nothing happens so when we get the eight of hearts it's a really good sign that now we can finally put energy into things and get that return of energy which is really nice it's like a moving forward card and finally you have another um, hearts card which is great so love is definitely good for those of you that are looking for love this week as well um, but three of hearts is all about emotional happiness feeling happy and with this many hearts cards it should be just like a happy good positive week so Looks really nice, and I think you will have a great week, so thank you for watching.